Hello YouTube, this is Rhino Good Stuff here, bringing you another video. This video is going to be about how to put music on your Blackberry for free. So yes, you heard me. This video is going to be about how to put music on your Blackberry for free. So it can work on any Blackberry. All you need is your mobile network. And if you don't have a mobile network, you can use your wireless router. So let's go ahead and get started so this is the blackberry i'm going to be using this is the blackberry curve 8520 but this one has a different back to it as i changed it so yeah this is just a normal blackberry 8520 you can see so yeah so let's go ahead and get to to start so let's go ahead and get show you so now you're gonna have to connect to your blackberry to the a wireless router or you can use your mobile network if you have one as you can see up there i already am connected to your wireless router up there so let me just get it to focus so i am connected to a wireless router to check if you are you just look up there and if you're not, this I will show you how to connect it. First thing you need to do is press the black blackberry symbol here. And go and find the manage connections. So this symbol there. Once you found that, press press that. Press it. And then a list of words should come up like this. And then if your if your net Wi-Fi is off like the way and like this. You're gonna have to go connect it on, so let's go ahead and connect it. So go to the wireless network, press select, and then it should, and there should be a tick next to it, and then another tick, a green tick next to it. So once it has a green tick, then it means it's connected. So that just tells you that it's on. So now let's go to scroll down and go to set up Wi Fi network, and then this, and then click on scan for networks and it will be scanning for various networks so this will only work for wireless routers so as you can see I am now connected so if you want to know how to do it first thing you will need to do is find the wireless router of your choice once you found it you go ahead and press it on it so just all you have to do is press select onto that and then if it has a password it should say this wi-fi has a personal password then you then you and then you type in either it says to type it in into the wi-fi router or as your blackberry will generate every pin which you have to either write it into the wi-fi router or you can just press the blackberry symbol right there so right here and then you click that and then and then it should come up where you can write it onto your blackberry so you just write the password of the wireless router to know where the password is on your wireless router i'll be i'll show you right now so here is my full band i am on talk talk so to know if you um to know the password of your full band all you need to do is turn the router around and then it will it will tell you on the back of the router so there is the name i have just cut out the password so i don't want anyone to know the password so here's the name of the router and then here's going to be the password there or you can go there and it will tell you but it will tell you there but that is where the main password is so once you have the parser which is written here, then you go back to your BlackBerry. So let's go ahead and go back to our BlackBerry right now. So once you have received your um, password, just type it in. And then once you've typed in, press connect. And once you are connected, to know if you are connected, it will say connected in brackets right there. So then you just press go all the way back and, t and go back. And now... This, so now you're connected to your wireless router as you see up. So let me just let that go in focus. 
so it will tell right up there if it, if you're connected then I am connecting and if you don't have a wireless router but you have a, a router but you have to have a cable for it just go call up your um, router company and then tell them how to connect how to make it wireless so once you have done that so that's just a little stuff if you if you if you if your router only does cable so once you have connected your blackberry to the wireless router or if you if you don't have a wireless router but you have your um uh, you have your own network on your blackberry then that's okay just skip it until here so now you go to browser so browser is this one click onto that and now you just follow what i write p b r u b i t u b i d y dot com oops daisy dot com so once you have to write all this stuff so once you have write that just write t u b i d y dot com so it's pronounced to b d once you have write that press the enter button so let it load and then it should automatically have come onto this page if it doesn't go on to the first website link and it, it should come onto this this is the home page of tubd so yeah so this is the this is the home page you can make an account with tubd or if you already have one you can log in up here so here is the here on the search bar just write any song so let me think what song i should put on let me just put this song So I just wrote Beware by St. Paul. So once you have wrote the song and the artist, then you just press the enter or you can press the search button. So let it load. And then here you can see various um, video links to the songs of your choice. So all you need to do now is find the video that is your choice. So let me just go scroll, so this is the song, this is the song that I want, so just click onto it, so you can click onto the blue writing or you can click onto it, the video itself, so let it just load, so now you just scroll down and then you have various um, um, links here, so the, the link, so the link you will need to go is is mp3 audio and it will tell you the size of the song so click onto mp3 audio and then a pop-up will come out and say do you want to open or save this item you have to save it but if you want a if you just want to listen to the whole song just write open it would not save onto it and then yeah he will it will, now it will tell you if you want to change the name of it and if you do just just erase all of it so just press the delete button and delete all of it if you want but i'm just going to keep it like that so now from here you can set it as a ringtone or you can just save it and it will go to your song library and if you want you can change where it goes so it will go to on my dev on my device memory so once it's on that so now you just click on to save and now it will tell you, now we will be downloading the song onto your device. So now it's completed. Now you just go back. And then go to your music file. So media. And then go to music. All songs. And now let me just write down the song name. So let me see if I... 
So here you go, I found the song. So let's click onto that. So oopsie there's the album. So, so here's the song. So now I have downloaded the song. So this whole process is free and it only takes less than five minutes. So now you can listen to your song in relaxation. So, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like this video. Please favorite it. Please leave a comment down below if you liked it or if you have a problem with it. Just leave a comment down below and I'll get back to it. So please subscribe and yeah. I hope you like this video and please give me a shout out if you could. I'll, and then I've got all the links down below to the I've got links in the um, in the description of the site and I've got the and I've got all my social media if you wanna get in touch or if you wanna know what song um, what videos I'm gonna be doing in the future. So yeah, hope you enjoy this. Peace out.